one more practice tomorrow in preparation of the game. Um, really uh, thankful for how we've been treated. Uh, I think the people here at the Quick Lane Bowl, the Detroit Lions, uh, have really created a, a first-class experience for our players. I, I know they were enjoying it. Yeah, you know, Christmas Eve, uh, they're going to have some time on their own. If they're the families that are in town, they're going to get a chance to spend it with the families and with each other. I know that's always a, a special thing during bowl season. I have some memories from, from each of those games being here, and then the coaches, I'm sure, will spend time with their families because we won't really see them much tomorrow. You know, one of the unique things about playing a game on the 26th is the 25th becomes a real work day for us, and we got to get into the routine of uh, the day before the game procedure that we go through. Well, I think it's a for, it's a pro stadium, so it's a, it's a great venue. You got great um, sight lines for the cameras in terms of film and practice. Sometimes there's different. Um, challenges when, when you go to the high school stadiums or different places so you know, from that standpoint the setup is really good we have our locker room set up here the same way we do at home and it gives the players a chance to get acclimated I guess to the, the game situation being an indoor game uh, the punt returners get a chance to catch punts uh, indoors I think those things are helpful anytime yeah, anytime you're on the road and you see your section and I think will be well represented by the families and and hopefully some local Big Ten fans you know we're certainly in the heart of Big Ten country out here uh, I would hope that some of them will be out here at the game to to, uh, to support us and root us on and and there's no doubt that when you get to an away venue or a neutral site game like this is, that you definitely feed off the presence of your fan base.